to another video, guys. May the fourth be with you. How ironic, though. I got my uh, Star Wars shaker cup right here. Anyways, let's just get into today's topic and video. I wanted to make this because I'm constantly getting questions about this fairy. And um, now that I've had it over a year, um, I think it was uh, maybe two weeks ago when I looked at my calendar when I first got it. Um, so yeah, two weeks ago marked the one year anniversary of me having this fairing on my 2020 Low Rider S. And to this date is my favorite club style fairing. Like it's just perfection, it's clean. Now, if you've been following me for some time right now, you know damn well that I've gone through a handful of fairings on this bike. I first started off with the stock little uh, mini fairing that it comes with. This thing is pretty nice. It's a little dirty right now because it's just been laying in the garage. But then I wanted something bigger. I wanted something that was more of a club style type of look. I wanted more wind protection. And I wanted it to look different from the rest of the crowd. So I went with the Harley Davidson quarter fairing. This is the smoke shield that goes on top of it. Um, no, it is not for sale. I'm constantly being asked that question. This fairing is not for sale. Now for some time, I really love the aesthetics and I love the looks of this Harley Davidson quarter fairing. But as you all know, and some of you guys know, this fairing has a minor little defect, which the designing team didn't do so well, where it just kind of like, at high speeds, it'll kind of like, yeah, move away. It's very easy to take off, and it's just not designed properly. Um, if they could fix that little cork in the back and just, you know, put a little lock, some type of lock mechanism on there, then yeah, pretty cool, but yeah. After that, I wanted something bigger as well, so um, I got the Memphis Shades Road Warrior. I did an install video for this, and I've taken it on many, many journeys, many rides, and I, I gotta tell you, I really, really, really love this thing. Huge shout out to Memphis Shades as well, because they do support the channel, um, and I love working with those guys, they are great. Um, and their product and their quality speaks for itself. Don't just take my word for it, but there's tons of people out there who are rocking these uh, Memphis Shades Road Warriors, and it's, like I said, it, it, it speaks for itself. Now, after that, for some reason, I was like, you know what, I kinda like the Del Rey, and I kinda wanna give my bike something new for the summertime, a different look, so I ended up reaching out to them, and they were nice enough to send this out to me, and I love this Del Rey right here. I'm actually gonna switch this out today. Um, towards the video, we're gonna take the bike out for a ride, and I'm gonna talk about wind protection and everything looks on the Memphis Shades Road Warrior. And then after that, towards the end of the video, I'm gonna show you guys how easy it is to swap that Road Warrior for this Del Rey. So here's the cool thing about the company as well, because the clips and the hardware that it comes with that you're able to put on your bike always stays on the bike, right? So in the event where you have multiple uh, fairings by Memphis Shades, then it's just an easy little clip. If I want to rock out with a Del Rey today, I'll put this on. If I want to rock out with the Road Warrior, I'll put that on. If I want to rock out with the big windshield, I'll put that on. And it's just a simple click away on and off. It takes seconds. I'll show you guys towards the end of the video how that works. Now with that being said, let's take the bike on the road and let's continue the conversation. All right, so now that we're on the bike, let's talk about wind protection. One of my favorite things about this fairing I feel like it's the perfect size. Prior to me having this fairing on, I was getting a lot of wind on my chest. And as you know, if you're gonna be out and about trying to crush a few hundred miles in a day, that wind it could, could definitely be fatiguing, right? So this takes all that off your body and allows you not to get so tired so quick and just want to ride more, to be honest which is my favorite things. So anything coming against my chest is gonna be protected right now. Now you are gonna get some wind that's gonna come from around the fairing and it'll hit you up on top, but very minimal. Now, as far as the wind going over the um, windshield on top, at high speeds, you are gonna get some buffeting, obviously. But like I said, the main purpose is to keep all that wind off your chest right here. You're gonna get a minimal amount of buffeting on your helmet and minimal amount of buffeting like hitting like your shoulder area a bit coming off from the sides but that's about it now i do love the design of the inside part as well because it does give you an ample amount of space for you to add a bar bag the way i have set up right here um if you want to add in like a plex audio will fit perfectly with this fairing 
and uh, what's the uh, what's the uh, audio? Um, what's another one? Another brand that fits perfectly with this fairing as well. Um, so you can play around with that. Um, you're also able to play around with the color of the windshield. So I have the dark smoke on mine. This is also the 11 inch. I am constantly getting asked that question: How high is it? This is the 11 inch, and I am 5'7", and I look right over the windshield on top. So it's perfect level for me. Now, like I was saying, you're also able to switch out that windshield. So this is a dark smoke. Um, they do have a lighter one, and they do have a clear windshield as well so all preference whatever you like I prefer this color right here um, I just like that dark shade I think it goes very well with the bike suits it and it just complements the whole bike uh, the whole aesthetics of it now I am gonna be taking off the road warrior today just to show you guys how easy it is to uh, take off and add it on the Del Rey I'm gonna be rocking out the Del Rey for probably like a month or so maybe two months and then I'll switch back to this depending on depending on what my mood is but Kind of want to give this a break and put the Del Rey on. Um, just it, it changes the whole aesthetics of the bike as well. It just makes it look like a brand new bike, and I really like that that Del Rey. I think it's just something different. Very very cool. Not you know it's not something that you're gonna see on the road too much. <laughs> okay, now. I am also running the Moons MC headlamp with this fairing. So one thing that you do also need to have in mind is that if you are gonna be changing all lights and everything, um, even at, I, I believe with the stock light, you're gonna get a you're gonna have to uh, get a block for it. That way the uh, the light could be at the proper position for the fairing. Uh, it won't be all the way pushed in, which looks a bit weird, um, and it'll bring your light. Uh, to the surface and right to the front exactly nice and flush where you want it to be with the fairing now with that being said there's honestly no negative points that I can say about this fairing man um, uh, it comes in black that's it that's the only color it comes so if you do have a different color bike yes you are gonna have to um, get it painted and get it color matched um, so I mean that's like that's the only thing lucky enough for me i have a black bike so it looks perfect but i really have nothing bad to say about this fairing like i said like i love it i get plenty and plenty of compliments on it uh people are constantly hitting me up in the dm asking me about the height once again it's 11 inch once again it's a method shades road warrior um it's probably the hottest looking fairing on the market simple as that now with that being said i think we're going to turn around go back home and I'm gonna show you guys how easy it is to go from the Road Warrior to the Delray. Well, alrighty then, now that we're back in the garage, I'm gonna show you guys how easy it is to put this Delray on and replace the uh, Method Shades Road Warrior. So pretty simple, the top two clips that the uh, fairing comes with, you're just gonna push and lift and that's it that's how easy it was to take that off so these are the clips that i'm talking about so this will lock in um, and it'll lift up you just got to push this button and it opens up and then to lock in you just push all the way down and it locks in so real simple so now all we're gonna do is put this right in the same place where the road warrior is at push back and it uh, should be in after that That was locked in, and now, and now this was locked in as well. So as you can see, simple as A, B, C, simple as one, two, three. Memphis Shades Road Warrior, Memphis Shades Del Rey, and plenty, plenty of more on the website for you to check out. So I'm gonna be linking down the link to the website and their Instagram down below so you guys can check them out. Good quality stuff. It's gonna make your bike look super cool. Um, and super easy to play around with and take off. So um, if you wanna see the install on how I did it, super simple as well, I'm gonna link it up at the end so you guys can check that video out. And finally, a huge thank you to Memphis Shades for sponsoring today's video as well. Like always guys, let the force be with you or may the force be with you. Ride safe and enjoy the ride, baby.